Good afternoon, sports fans. My name is Magnitude. And uh, as you guys just saw, Yusuke injured. Yeah, that's why we haven't seen him uh, on 16 yet. So Goku has the option of dropping titles or picking a new tag team partner. And he's choosing to pick a new tag team partner next week. I'm sure to watch out for that. Well, yeah, if your options are don't be champion or still be champion. Yeah, well, I mean, he gave the option. But still be champion. Who knows, you know? Yeah, but this is for the hardcore title, Trevor. Hardcore title on the line. And it's going to be the challenger. Oh. The challenger. Captain Ginyu, winner I'm of the impressed. 2015 King of Trios. It's true, one third of the King of Trios. Yes, the, the winning, yeah, him and uh, who else was on that? Rikum and, and Jace. 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 Here comes Keel. This model looks amazing in this Doesn't game. Doesn't it? It really does. Whoever did this, great job. Captain Ginyu, I think, would be a crowd favorite. He'd be like a Bo Dallas kind of heel. Oh, yeah. Where he thinks everyone just loves him. <laughs> yeah. What is he What is he doing? What is he writing in the air? Well, he's writing Ginyu. Of course. Of course he is. What a great looking model. Does that guy made anybody else in the Ginyu Force or just Captain Ginyu? I <laughs> just Captain Ginyu. That's, see, that's the real travesty in all this. No Wakanda. Is there more Wakanda beer? Imperial IPA. Stout. Imperial Stout. Imperial. Oh, I might get some of that. Raiden beer. Ooh, I got it. Sponsor. Can we, let's see if we can get a sponsor going, huh? Yeah. But probably not, but you know. Here comes the hardcore champion, Colossus. Who Looking has for number two. One title offense to his name. Which means he's one, if he wins this, he's one win away from possibly having to make a decision. Yes, yes, yes. And that decision is Trevor. Yeah, that'd be either um, a, cha a championship belt he can't go for, the Adamway Championship, or one that he can go for, the Tag Team Championship. Correct, him and a partner, so who knows? I'm not feel. saying that, like, he would. Just, yeah, but uh, here's Colossus. I just used the Hardcore Title Belt from the game, and that's, that's what I did. I, I didn't even bother you. No way. No. Yeah. Colossus, coming in hot. Quad City DJ. Damn that song! Yeah, twerk. <laughs> What was it called? Twerk something? Um, let's see. From Quad City DJs, we got... So it was like Twerk something? It was, uh... Four Minutes Workout. Four Minutes Workout. Yeah, that's a good and one. And the song that I have stuck in my head is Hey DJ. Which is a chick saying Quad City. It's hey only DJ been played 27,000 times. Yep. Oh, God. The fact that there's no Space Jam on this really saddens me. Yeah, it's like they're iconic. Unless they don't own the rights to it anymore. I suppose that's possible? I, I, I don't know. Maybe? Space Jam soundtrack. Uh, no. It's like three minutes long. Yeah, and it's only got... Yeah, I don't know, man. That's weird. I don't know. Why? Hardcore championship Whoa. graphic. Why you wouldn't have the Space Jam soundtrack on Spotify is just... Sad state of affairs. Captain Ginyu. Colossus. Who do you got in this match, Trevor? Uh, Colossus. Yeah, Captain Ginyu. Ride the King of Trios wave. It's been like a year. I mean, keep riding the wave. Mini Force beat my team in the finals, so. Keep riding the wave. Well, I mean, it wasn't really your team. It was a team that your brand uh, that represented your brand, but I wouldn't say you would like to associate well, with them. They were assholes, but they were my assholes. Yeah, but they're also bees, Trevor. Uh, <laughs> Do you feel like associating yourself with bees, with asshole bees, Trevor? Because that's what you're doing right now. Mm. Uh, the Unwashed aren't anything anymore, are they, on your, on your show? Who? Unwashed. They're kind of gone, aren't they? Essentially. They accomplished everything they were trying to accomplish, so they're just kind of like... Mutually disbanded. Mutual disbansion. It's not a... Uh, disbansion is not a real word, by the way. So don't even... So, Trevor, you got, uh... You got, uh... Colossus in this matchup? Oh, yeah. Colossus, Colossus, co... co I got Captain Ginyu. There's no way I don't. Very I mean... Captain Ginyu... Very good tag team wrestler. <laughs> yeah. Can't say that I trust him as a singles wrestler. I don't think I've seen him as a singles wrestler. Exactly. So I don't even know if I can or not. I, don't, I have no idea. Oh, Come on, ride the train and ride it. Flip Cup is going to be so hype. Uh, yeah, it usually is. It usually is. Because that 90s playlist is specifically reserved. Oh, it's like for a Flip, Flip Cup. Cup only kind of thing, huh? I see, I see. Come on, ride the train. Then ride it. My guess is that it's played during Flip Cup. And then after Flip Cup finishes, it just keeps going. I like it. It's Colossus into the, the, the pole on the outside. There's the hardcore championship. There are no rules at all. 
That is false count somewhere, I'm assuming. False count somewhere, yeah, I think so. I don't know. Because if it's extreme rolls, it's false count. I don't know. That's my guess, at least. Well, your guess might be a good one. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And again, I reserve the right to not know. And I don't know. So. Slam him right on that on that concrete on the outside. We don't have a safety net here, ladies and gentlemen. No, we do not. No, we do not. You know, what a punch by Colossus. Yeah, me on blue, I'm worried about injuries, so I'll just like Well, I just use K literally just got injured at a house show. Yeah. So uh, you know. I should be worried about injuries, but you Seth Rollins them. I did, I did. Just keep kicking him in the balls. It's legal. It's like like nine of them. It's like a, it's like a table over there, Trevor. Oh, your poor wife. <laughs> Head to the steel. Talk show. Good movie. Great. Oh, man. Good good film. So what we were talking about in our last video? Yeah. Oh, what you're gonna hear us talk about in four days because <laughs> we don't timelines. Oh. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peace. So that's a, this is a weird thing we got going on right now. No, that means we shouldn't talk about it. Uh, yeah, let's not talk about it. Yeah, let's not talk let's about wait. it. Let's wait. Let's wait on it. We got plenty of time to do it. Because we'll make a video about it. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. So this is us announcing that in our next video we make an announcement <laughs> saying that we're going to announce something in a video later on. What the hell? Deadlift German. That was pretty dope. Pertaining to you, the viewers, though. Yes. So if you've ever done an EFED... This is your 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 time will be shining. Fucking Pandora's box. Oh yeah, we have opened it. It has been opened. I could go to this tomorrow if I wanted to. I could from that. Yeah. Is the guy gonna die? Oh, he walks away. So no. Holy shit! That is yeah. That is quite quite. Yeah, that didn't happen when I saw him. That he car just blew up, dude. What the fuck? Yeah. Just blew up around him. Yeah. How? Walked away. Yeah, there he is, right there. He's like, oh my god, he must be shitting his pants, dude. Yeah. What the f- how do you do that? And he's going like 300 miles an hour. No. You can never talk shit about that man. No. Anything he ever does in his life. Oh, that's part of his car right He's just hanging out. What a punch! Like Captain Ginyu. Where is the New England drag strip? That could be anywhere in New England. And oh, this happened like today? Yeah. It's like happening this weekend. No, no, that one crashed accident. Oh, yeah, today. What? That's nuts. That's crazy, dude. And Captain Ginyu... Oh, big power bomb. Captain Ginyu looks like a man on fire right now, dare I say. You know me. I'm not one to dare say. Oh, the strength of Colossus. These are two, just two behemoths. Behemoths. Slugging it out right now. Where are you, New one Dragway? 179 miles. Ooh, that's a while. It is a trip. How many miles? 179. Yeah, we don't go to that. No. It's probably no. Like, like the tip of fucking like New York somewhere. That's New Hampshire. New ha yeah, Ugh. we're not doing that. We're not doing that. Oh, oh a spine buster by Colossus. Like, I feel like a lot of the appeal to watching drag racing for me was watching four of them race at the same time. I can see that. It's, it's four of them racing at the same time. I understand. What a DDT by Colossus. With two of them racing at the same time, you're just like, oh, it's, it's two. That is two of them. The cover, what? No, oh, two, sorry. Because a lot of races little and little drag eye. races are like one smokes the tires and the other one wins. Yeah, I, I used to be... I, I kind of so like drag racing. Oh, so fun. if one smokes the tires, you still got three. You're right. Colossus! With a deal, Trevor? That no one kicks out of? No one kicks out of the deal. Except maybe getting in here. One! Two! two. Oh, oh, so close. Apparently people kick out of the deal, Trevor. What a shame. Apparently people kick out of the deal. Is it a shame? No selling people's finishers. <laughs> it's not a finisher. Well, it's a deal. Of course it's a finisher. <laughs> God damn it. Who does that move? <laughs> I don't know. Who does the deal, Trevor? Huh? Um. Yeah, that's what I thought. The fact that no one... Oh, Dance of the Renaissance Fair. All right. With, uh... Swank. Yeah. Liz. LJ. Okay. Kato. Brian. Heather. Okay. Wait, is Liz Sweet D? No. No. Oh. I don't know, Liz. Can you? Oh, rake of the eyeballs with Colossus. And then a wrestling that takedown. Like living in like the 1930s. It does. It does. She's nice, though. Nice girl. Used to be Will's old uh, roommate. Liz. I don't recall. I don't yeah, know. I don't think you were, like, tight with us back then. Probably not. 
Scoop slam by Colossus. It's a deal. No one kicks out of the deal. No one. One. Two. Oh, damn. Ah! <laughs> damn. He didn't kick out of the deal. He, he it, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he did not kick out of the deal. Okay. Colossus retains. Which means he's facing someone. On uh, Blue 63. Blue 63. Not 62, though. 63. Captain Ginyu. This is, this is his... Uh, not, oh, he's 0-2 in his uh, Night Nation tenure. Oh, that's no good. No, it's not any good, but, you know, there he is. 0-2. Come on, baby. That old Undefeated in King Trios. Winless. And <laughs> he's, he has... Let's see. Captain Ginyu has two... Or one singles loss... Can't think of there he is. Fuck. One singles loss and one f uh, fatal four loss. Money in the bank. Fatal four. Was it a qualifier? Probably. Probably. Yeah. Well, it's tough to count because you know there's four people. And you might not even be involved in the decision. Mm-hmm. Can't think of though. Gave it all. He's all. But Colossus is moving on. He's gonna go up one on the ladder. The hardcore title ladder that I've created, and the graphic's gonna change if we get more people because it just it has to. It's I, I keep thinking of like going down like the motorcycle. Yeah, but again, at the same time, I only have like a certain number of. Oh no, I'm I'm saying like in my mind. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay. In my mind, that's what I think is happening. I see you. Okay, Colossus. See you, baby. Shake that ass. Shake that ass, bitch, and let me see what you got. Oh my god, I found a good version of that. It's called the Cleveland Shake. That's disturbing. That is disturbing. But it's got like that, uh, just shake that ass, bitch, and let me see what you got. It's got that. Except it's over, um, whole, um, oh god. I forget what it's called. Whole something. Whole something. It's by a band named Whole. Which class is, though, number two. So, with different colored numbers for different different prizes they could get. It's my picture, Vince. What? It's my picture, Vince. So, anytime Vince McMahon is referenced. <laughs> okay, good stuff. Good stuff. All right, we have a tagged women's tournament. I guess why it's a tag team. Women's tournament. Sarah Bella. Do you know who that is, Trevor? You think she's from a game called Rumble Roses? I think. Oh. I think. She's fucking weird. Hold on. Is that another one of those games that, like... Skullgirls. Whatever the hell that is. People are very, un like, into the Rumble Roses thing. It's, much like the Dead or Alive thing. It's Skullgirls. And uh, Hawk Girl, as you know her from the Marvel. Yeah. DC. The, the DC. The, the DC. Now I got 140 free gigs. Yeah, buddy. And there is the match card. Hawk girl. Huh. Huh. Yeah. Unfortunately for her, she can't carry a mace in this hawk game. Hawk woman. Hawk girl, hawk woman. Is it's it the same thing? Is it though? Is it? I thought hawk girl was the right one. Oh, uh, that's... Uh, let's see. Let's figure that out. I'm, I'm on recon here. Is uh, your you got your thing in there? Alrighty. Well, here we are in Los Angeles, California. See, that's Hawk Girl. It's the same thing. Unless Hawk Woman like her mother. Or if Hawk Woman. Hawk Woman. Oh shit. She's the same one that like is just like all grown up. Uh, is that Hawk Woman? Let's find out. We get Hawk Girl and Hawk. Oh, oh, same person. Yeah. Okay. So just her all grown up. Sweet. All grown up. What's she carrying? Uh, pom pom? It's a long pom pom. Ah! What is that? Uh, pom pom? No, it's. A head of some kind? That she oh. just threw away? I understand what that was! Yeah. It's like symbiote suit or something from Spider Man 3. I don't know. She has this weird thing where she has like a, like a weird head and it was like. Uh, like, and it's like arms and shit. I don't know. Okay. Years before the events told the invasion story, Fel Andar, a hybrid human Thangarian spy, was sent to Earth to infiltrate trade among humans. Eventually, he met and married an Earth woman, Sharon Parker, who would soon give birth to Charlie Parker, later known as the Golden Eagle. Mm. She's four years old, called Andar to active duty, so he joined the Justice League International, going to be Carter's son. Anta never told the Thargarian Empire about Charlie, so that reminds me of someone, forcing me to be that Gary. And then he have Hawkwoman, Sharon Hall, wife of Carter Hall. Okay. Wow. 
That's a lot of backstory here. Hawk girl! That's a lot of backstory. Actually, it's not as much as um, Moon Knight. Moon Knight, has a, Moon Knight had a lot of fucking backstory. In the early 1990s, Thargarian police well, men partners, Guitar Hole and Shayera Thai. All right, just stop. Arrived on Earth. The match started. You're making, you're, you're, you're offending so many people right now. <laughs> I don't know what any of these names are. What do you got on this match, Trevor? Sarah, Hawk Girl, Sarah, of course. All right, I guess I got Sarah Bella for the... Google Sarah Bella. Google which looks like, like her fucking model. It's weird. All right. Google. Hawk Girl, though. Sarah Bella. This is the final match of the first round. After this, we go to the second round. Sarah Bella? C-E-R-E-B... Or C-E-R-E-B-E-L-A. -E -E Sarah Bella. Two, two L's. Yeah, right there. Sarah Bella. Uh, yeah, look at that. She's what like, the... Yeah, right? She had this weird thing up against the ropes here. Right? That's kind of weird, right? I mean, it's what? close. It's a close model. What even? Right? I don't know, dude. I don't know. I don't know. It's a, it's a weird looking like thing in her head, right? I, I couldn't explain it. It's like it's, arms. It's like she has the arms from that big orange thing uh, from the Monstars, just on her head. Yes. Yeah, we, another up against the rope spot. The ref has really probably got to break that up. I mean, he did. So credit where credit is due. She's got his arms. She does have his arm. <laughs> I thought you Googled it just to show me, just so I know for sure. Yeah. Well, of course. And apparently all of them were, uh... Oh, God. What? Who, who wore zeros? Who wore zeros? Hibachi, that guy. Hib that was Hibachi. On the Wizards? Uh... Nene? No, he didn't Brought lose. guns into the locker room? Uh, Ron Artest that one time? No. I have no idea who wore zero on the Wizards. I don't. I don't. I have no he idea. He was big for like a year. Oh, I, I have no idea, dude. I don't know, man. I'll probably know when I hear it. Agent Zero. That's probably that's it. that's that's Gilbert Arenas. Yep. Oh, that's what I was thinking of. Oh. Gilbert Arenas. Who, who did I say? Uh, I was thinking. I was thinking of Gilbert Arenas. He's one of the worst contracts in the history of sports. Yeah, because he was good for that one year. Yep. Hibachi. Hibachi. All right. He's on the monsters. There's a match happening. Is he? Is that, is that what you're going with? He's on the monsters? He's the L1 number zero. And he treated the Gilbert Arenas. Of course he did. Even though, you know, he was. Whatever. Hawk Girl, what strength? Dropping Sarah Bella right in her I noggin. I get distracted. I feel bad. Okay. You do get distracted. That's right. I get distracted too. Well, you, you do work when you're, like, on your computer. <laughs> Me, I look up Gilbert Arenas. Look up his contract. Seriously, look up his contract. <laughs> All right. Look up. It's, it's like it's one of the worst contracts in history of professional sports. What? A, that's like a that's some kind of a weird sideways move that I got to cover. One, two. Sarah Bell kicking out. Contract. You won't believe how much money Gilbert Arenas made in 2013. Yeah. Yeah. All right. It's awful. Sarah Bell into the corner. Sarah Bella though. <laughs> the latest issue of Kiss Me the Magazine features a compilation of the highest paid athletes in the world. Gilbert Arenas is on it. Yes, that Gilbert Arenas. The Gilbert Arenas has been out of the league since 2012. Yeah. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Uh, he's number 30. Yeah. 22 million. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't play. NBA and this team. Yep. He made 22 million. <laughs> Just hang out at his house. He did. That contract was the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my you life. You could buy a lot of fireworks with 22.3 million. The cover. Two. Another near fall. He signed a six year, 111 million contract in 2008. Yep. He traded to the Magic in 2010. The Magic used the Adam Music Clause on Reese in 2011. So his salary doesn't count against the teams that I have. <laughs> oh my god. Yep. Uh, Hawk Girl, this again, the raw strength dropping Sarah Bella right in her Let's body. Let's go, Hawk Girl. The cover on Sarah Bella's not a lot of offense right now. It's kind of disappointing because her model looks pretty cool. Well, yeah, but she's going against a Hawk Girl. But Sarah Bella's arms, dude. Well, she doesn't have the arms here because they're illegal. Yeah, but, you know. Much like Hawk Girl's wings. They're there in spirit. She's throwing a Sarah Bella getting out of the ring. As Hawk Girl throws a punch and she just leaves the ring. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, did I turn off disqualification? Nope, they're still on. Alrighty, I think she's just gonna go for, uh... Fair enough. Okay, that's, uh... That's how we're gonna play this. That's weird. Sarah Bella into the ring. Yeah, I'm pretty sure disqualifications are still on. She went to grab a weapon to get disqualified. Huh. That's a new level of AI. 
I haven't seen before. Alrighty. Yeah, no, it comes up every once in a while. They, they just want to get disqualified. Yep. Okay. The cover. One, One two, two. End it. That was brutal. Short. Yes. Hawk girl doesn't come in a jar. Hawk girl. That's a bug juice joke. <laughs> Sarah Bella. Disappointing. Well, NHRA, you really got to get better TV times. What are they Qualifying at? already happened. It's going to get shown on TV at midnight. Oh, that's uh, brutal. NHRA. How many likes do they have on Facebook? It's probably underwhelming, isn't it? Like 13,000 or something. Oh! Oh, a million. Okay, never mind. NHRA is like sneakily popular. Never mind, dude. Good. Like for the place them. that I was at was packed, packed, and it was like the most diverse crowd. So like women there, like et different eth ethnicities to make me not sound racist. Ah, different eth different ethnicities. Men, women, children, and like they had like one of their best drivers is a black guy. Okay. Well, another one of their best drivers is John Force's daughter. That's true. He also has another driver that's also really good. It's just the most diverse sport. No one talks about it. Why does this happen so quickly? So you can't like sit down and like watch a drag race. Like you have to watch drag racing. You know what I mean? I guess uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't. Know. Yo, these recaps they are forever with horrible camera angles. You yeah. can turn them off. Well, nah. Give this time to unwind after the match. It does decompress. Get ready for another one. Did you end up uh, seeing our draft video? Uh, nah, did not. I'm gonna watch that at some point. What sucks is that for whatever reason, my mic was lower than everyone else's. Well, you could just change that. Yeah, it was too late. Oh, <laughs> it was. It was just like that. Does suck. Yeah. Then I was just like, I don't care. Oh, no, that's funny. You could still you could still hear me clear. So I was like, whatever. Okay. So there is our final four. Yes. Uh, said Sue Kieran versus Poison Ivy and Morgan Aslan versus Hawk Girl. Wait, Wings versus Wings? Wait, didn't Nina win that match? Ah, oh, I fucked that up. Did she? Oh, yeah, dude. Nina won that match for sure. For sure, for sure. Really? Yep. Well, what actually I'm probably going to do is uh, post production change that to Nina. So you're not even going to see that as Morgan. You're going to see that. I'm pretty sure fucking Nina won that match. I'm pretty sure. 704? Uh, yeah, go up. It's like right, it was right in the middle? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, that's the first, uh, match lasted a while. Jesus. <laughs> literally. Jesus. Quite literally, yes. Uh, yeah, I know, I, unless. Nope! Oh, really? She won that? Got it right! Oh, so never mind. I guess that's not gonna be post production. I really thought that she won. Okay, here we go. Space uh, Ghost and Raiden, best of seven series. Tied at one. It we is. got ourselves a series, boys. Yeah, it's no sweep in other direction. Nope. And, uh, so the, it's the best of seven, which means after, you know, they got, they're got they going to wrestle seven times. or four, Whoever wins four to seven times is the new champion, and the other person can no longer challenge that person. It is title. effectively a best of five series now. Yes, because they both won one. First to three wins. Yes, that is. That is. Here we are now in Seattle, Washington. I keep... I always have the problem with not Home changing of not it. the Sonics. Not changing it to my arena, because I always forget, because it's like not obvious like it used to be. I know. It, it, it gets ingrained in you after a while. Yeah, I, I can imagine. Well, it took me a little bit, but I, I got there. Well, I'm glad you got, you got there. What I will do after you leave mm -hmm. is finally upload the Big Bang and Purple Arenas. Yes. So you can get the, pre the pay-per-view prepared. Yes, need that. For not next week. Not the week after, but the week after that. Yeah. So the 19th, roughly? Roughly. Because we'd, have, we'd be recording purple and green on the 11th, or green in the paper, depending on how you feel. Yeah, we'll have to, uh... We'll have to... Because right now is the 4th, and then you got green in the 6th, blue in the 9th, and then green in the 13th, Purple on the 16th, maybe. So the pay per view is on the 19th. June 19th. Which would mean the end of July. Like July 31st or something like that. For, uh. Like, we could have, a, like, a long way to go for, like, for GT5. Yeah. And we have the road to 
GT5. That way I could have the Road to Gold tournament. That's what I'm doing. 16 man tournament. I or I can make it even bigger if I want to. I can make it as big as I want. That's what she said. I have my Road to Gold event. That's going to have that as the uh, the main event tonight. So this is not the main event. It's the main event after this involving the Road to Gold participants. Well, it that picture did get you a lot of views last time. Did it? Yeah. I don't remember. Yeah, they, they all like compound because like it's not like Pokemon Wi-Fi Battle 19. It's like here's See, fucking like, Kratos. And you shit. have people that get your views. Yeah, I know what I was doing. 914? Yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. And here we go. Who do you got in this match, Trevor? Space Ghost or the Raiden? Uh, Raiden. Alrighty. I guess I'm going to have to go with Space Ghost because I do love me a... He's, he's Mr. Midcard Championship. Do love me a Space Ghost. Oh, of course. <laughs> Three and Fifth Ellis Tag Match. Like, they're all hovering around here, but like... Yeah, they look good there. They'll get there. They build. Ugh. Well, it's good to see that like our paper you still get like a lot of views. They though. do get a lot. I they do get a lot, which is wonderful. Tie up in the middle of the ring. These are two now. Like, these are two really good wrestlers. Oh yeah, it's like four thousand views. Yeah, yeah buddy. They get a show. Up. Combo Royal Rumble getting thirty six. We need to do another Royal Rumble. We do. I actually have one in the tank. Arm drag. What is it? Um, just, just oh, a just bunch a of guys. Rumble. Yeah. Are we approaching eight hundred videos? Yeah, that's why I did it. Yeah, there you go. But what I could do is, again, like, I feel like I'm getting a little sick, so I might not do, be all that active today. Uh-huh. So I could, like, you just, like, throw me, like, five or ten guys that you want on, like, your uh, big thing. Yeah. What we could do, uh -huh. real quick, after, after green, uh -huh. is I could show you who's left from green on my roster. Okay. And you just tell me who else you would like in there. We each get 15. Cross branded Rumble. Yay! For a future world title shot. I like it. I like it. Yeah. Big fan of that. Because, like, the one that I had was, like, the, the one that I have mm -hmm. in the tank is stacked. I didn't think a 30 man Rumble from Blue, like, right after the drive was going to be as stacked as it was, but it was. I left off some people. Both our rosters significantly improved, I think. Oh, yeah. Because I got diversity and I got, like, more people to play with, and you got, like,. I got star power, which I needed. Exactly. Which I needed. You had all the star power. Well, I'm trying to create star power. But... Because, like, you had some people, but, like, the people that, like, I wanted weren't necessarily people that, like, you would have thought, like, first thought as, like, people that, like, you had to, like, put in, like, the main title scene, like, right away. Yeah. But since I'm putting them, like, in the main title scene and just seeing what they can do. Yep. And I'm sort doing the road to gold. Like, it, it, points. It, yeah, it broadened out my main title and mid-card roster. Yeah, because I got I got Trunks, Zangief. Yep. Yeah, you snagged all Red Death for me, you bastard. Yeah, I, the fact that I'm even putting Red Tornado in, like, yeah, the, the next um, hardcore championship, like, to see who's going against uh, Colossus. Against Colossus. It was Colossus. <laughs> he won his match. Just gonna re show you like who's in this. Yeah, no, oh that's my a, God, that this is match. that is gonna be a yeah. that's a fucking thumbnail and a half right there. Yeah, because people are gonna confuse him with Vision. Yep, and that was View Town USA. Falcon Taskmaster Booster Gold Cable Red Tornado. And Not this week on Blue. Well, next week on Blue. Blue sixty three for Chuck Bound. Still blue. Yeah, blue and Ta look how dope Taskmaster looks. I know he looks. I'm kind. <laughs> I regret not picking him up for that. Like, he looks really good. And you can also have, like, classic Taskmaster. I'm like, why would I want classic Taskmaster? That's yeah, lame. It's just, like, it looks like a bastardized version of Skeletor. Or I could just have a really dope-looking... Yeah. No. Well, you're right. You're right. He looks really cool, I don't think. Well, Swank, a fine-looking pirate wench. That's what she's going for. Is she losing weight? She is. Looks like she's losing some weight. Good for her. Alrighty. Good for, yeah, good for her. I know. I'm getting skinnier. She's getting skinnier. The world. Guy is... on the right thinks he's getting skinnier. Mm, yeah, I don't know what's happening with that. I I think he's stagnant. I'm not gonna tell him. I'm sure let's get back to him somehow. Yeah, but I'm already down like one shirt size. Yeah, are you? Nice. Yeah. Sweet dude. Yeah, I've gotten down from like. The shirt size that, like, I need to actually, like, put in early to get shirts now. Instead of, like, 
Hey, everyone has, like, these shirts are always available because it was only me and a guy that is now dead getting them. <laughs> ominous. Quite ominous. You'd think that would have been a warning sign to me. Not so much. Not so much. <laughs> hey, the other guy that wore this shirt is dead. Maybe I should improve my health somehow. Nah, he died because of pneumonia. <laughs> it wasn't anything else. <laughs> Just pneumonia. Just pneumonia, huh? Yeah. All right. He also had sleep apnea. <laughs> oh, a bummer. I didn't know that until afterwards, though. Sleep apnea. We're in a Bane mask. Sleep apnea. We discussed sleep apnea way more than we probably should on this show. What are you looking for? My airhead. I'm airheadless. I don't think you bought any. Didn't you give me one, is what I'm saying? No, I didn't. Oh, I thought you did. All, All right. right. I'm keeping watermelon. You I, want, did, no, no, that's, I thought you, you want, gave me one. No, I don't need one. You want orange cherry or mystery? No, I'll take the orange cherry. It's the shittiest one. You said orange cherry. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> I thought it was like flavor. No, I guess I'm orange shitty. cherry or oh, mystery. Oh, oh. <laughs> I get orange, I guess. Thanks. It's okay. like a dollar. Don't worry. Airheads like, suck. This candy is awful. Like, it tastes like kind of weird. It is. It like, tastes weirdish. I don't know why I, b I have a sore throat and I decided to buy that. Yeah, that was, that was a decision you made. This is throat irritation, city. It's a weird town to go to. Why are we go there? Let's, let's reroute our GPS to get away from here. Yeah, I got things that would... Neither things would benefit my throat. What the Peanut fuck? Peanut butter m I don't know. You it's because water, it's... dude. I already have water. Oh, okay. I'm probably going to be at grocery store after this, though. Are you? Well, like, later on tonight. Okay. Because I need to buy dinner. Because I don't want to keep getting takeout. So I want to get, like, dinner, breakfast, lunch. Cover one, two, two. no. Kick it, two. They're exhausted. I know. I haven't even been that long ago. They know time. how important this game is. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Because this is the one that could turn the tide here. It always does. There's no home, home court in this one, like uh, the last Best of Seven series we had, Vegeta and Captain Pollution. Remember the Pollution Arena? Yeah. Oh, yeah! Holy shit, remember that? Yeah. They're now on the outside. All games are in a neutral site. It's like seven Super Bowls, back to back to back. No, no. Okay, okay. Seven Super Bowls. All right, they're getting counted out here. Yeah. What's the count? Fuck if I know, dude. Yeah, what pisses me off now is that he uses two hands for every single count. So you can't even tell. You have to, like, look at his fingers. That's disappointing. Yeah, because, like, the display counts are on in my settings. Mine too. I actually had to double check. Mine too, dude. I don't care. And for us to go back and, like, edit one, two... No way. Fuck that. So hard. Yeah. We're not no fucking way. Ever. Cover. One. Two. two. So what, it's, it still won't help with the commentary. So. Exactly. Ah, fuck that noise, dude. What is this? I don't know. Okay, so I almost had to go to a job on Monday before I drove to Georgia. What? Yeah, because my name was on the paperwork. It's just that I don't know who did it because both Pete and Rob were like, no, you're not doing that. And I'm like, then wh one of you put my name on this. <laughs> Close line of misses. Oh! I love the misdirection. Yeah. It was only like, like 3,500 out of storage units. So it wouldn't be that bad. Mm -hmm. And I'm just like, can I just leave at 8 in the morning? <laughs> that, is that an option? Because Georgia is probably about 1,000 miles away. And i got to do like 500 and 500. If I'm driving the truck that I called Murphy because if anything could happen to the truck it has the same truck that I got rear-ended in mm -hmm. the uh, work light shorted and caught on fire that one the cover one two. two the electrical problems where you hit a bump on the highway and the speedometer died oh no the, or the yeah it was the speedometer was that the one that the fuse kept fucking blowing yeah. oh I was supposed to go to Virginia and they said they said never mind yeah they were like what do I do I'm like keep driving it's, it's Saturday it's one o'clock on a Saturday yeah. we're not breaking down here. We, just, we just brought it back like alright <laughs> just left <laughs> yep I was supposed to go to Virginia 
on the way down with like Billy in my truck, which just broke down. So they got ahead of us, brought it back, and then they're like, "All right, Ricky, well, I was gonna go instead." Like, it's been three hours of you just sitting around. I keep pushing my will to make Ricky drive this new truck. I'm Second like, rope. Uh oh! Oh god! Brain Buster! Oh, that hurt. Yeah. When you do a top rope brain buster, you have to yell "Brain Buster." It's just top the, rope. Space the goes. Law. Space goes. He's perched. Oh, that was like a little tadpole splash. It's perfect because it's got a sleeper that I don't want to deal with. Fuck and it, sleepers. And it only goes 63 miles an hour. I was like driving Miss Daisy in like Indiana. Like, and then I was like, all right, I'm going to take it on 70 and see what it can do. And I'm like, 60. Six, it's 1965. It's four, it's 1965. Governor, huh? Governor at 63. Like, like, uh, Papa, Papa Will was just like, he's like, oh, it's got a Cummins motor, it's probably, it, it can go. I'm like, yeah, it can. <laughs> Doesn't, but <laughs> could. <laughs> he's like, what do you mean? I'm like, Governor. He's like, how bad? 65, like, 63. He's like, oh. Blue Thunder Bomb! One, two, near kick fall. at it, two. Near fall. Yeah, he's like, well, it'll be good in Connecticut, though. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's just that, like, any, like, the entire way back, like, doing 600 miles in that thing was a bitch on Thursday. That's gonna suck. Moonsault, standing. But right. you can go, like, 500 miles on a tank of gas, so it, like, almost evens up. Yeah, that doesn't sound terrible, then. Yeah, like, I filled up in Indy, and I didn't need gas until, like, Pennsylvania. That's pretty good. Dude. So Space goes hit Raiden with fucking everything. Yeah, he cannot put Raiden away. Top rope brain buster. Can't put him away. Uh-oh. He's got him some kind of a weird chicken wing type maneuver. Well, it's called the Koji Clutch. The Koji? Who did who did that move? Koji. Koji what? I uh, don't Never even heard of that guy. Me neither. Uh, oh, oh, <laughs> oh. I thought it was like some... No, it, that's... Well, this space goes pretty the fourth wall. Is. Sami Zayn's move set, so... Yes, he does. That's what the move's actually called. Like, Nightwing has Sami Zayn's moveset, and it's called the Gotham Gate. Ah! Yeah, well, it's all coming together now, isn't it? And I was trying to, like, uh, on the fly think of, like, something that rhymed with ghost. Not much. Just coast, roast, boast, host, toast. That's what I was thinking, ghost toast, but I was like, no, that, that's, that sounds... that's the Haunted Mansion. <laughs> ghost toast. I'm your ghost host. What is this? Uh, counter by Raiden, though. Into a suplex. It's like fucking Space Guest was going for Stratisfaction. It was a bold move. Who, who knows he was a Trish Stratus mark? No one did. No one knew that, but apparently it's true. Yeah, her moves it actually, I just, I just started using it for uh, New Wrestler Psylocke. She's so hot right now. It's an apocalypse. That's right. Well, spoilers. If you were looking for her to do a lot in that movie, not so much. I one, I two... That's it! Ring it! Raiden! Picking up the W! I definitely suggest you watch X-Men Apocalypse, though. It's really good. I will, eventually. It'll happen. It's not as good as Civil War, but it might be a more entertaining movie from start to finish. Because Civil War has a lot of, like... It has a lot of action, but it has a lot of, like, really intense shit happening. Yep. And this one has, like, you know, like... Quicksilver running through the mansion, and, like... A few big fights and night crawlers in there. Night crawlers in there. Yep. It's up in the trailer. It sets up like a '90s X-Men movie with like all the baby X-Men, and like they're in it. They're actually wearing like their X-Men suits at the end. What? Two? Just counter the replay. That's all. Because I've you know we're winding down here in this match. That will lead us to our main event, which promises to be main. Oh, does it? Get ready for a marathon. Yeah, like, look how dope those costumes are. Oh, that's pretty dope. That's, uh, that's, spoilers, that's the end scene for, like, the movie. Not that picture, but, like, in general. Yep. But, like, their costumes, like, that is, like, legit Nightcrawler. Yep. Cyclops and, like, Mystique's are kind of fucking annoying in the movie. Uh, I have a character's always been annoying. But in this one, she's not even blue for, like, most of it. She, it's just like Jennifer or, um, Jennifer Lawrence just hanging out in jeans and a tank top for like half the movie. Like, hey, what's up? 
Did feel like wearing the makeup, so uh, here we are. All right, well, you know. The Quicksilver's so fucking good. So good. Right, and here we go, Road to Gold. The points. This is the current points that we're looking at right Ash. now. Ash. Come on, Ash. Uh, well, uh, oh, I have this picture. How long do I have this picture on for? Like fucking a minute and a half? Oh, okay. oh not really. <laughs> yeah, so uh, currently Opus Prime is singing eight points. Ash, you're op You're one of the best ever. Ash. Ash. <laughs> Ash. You're behind Kylo. I've been wrestling for like five matches, Ren. Ash with one point. Kratos with three or eight points. Kyle Ren with three points. Ray with two points. And Kazuya with eight points. I mean, this is gonna be an ongoing yeah, thing. Kazuya's been really good, Miss. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna be an ongoing thing. It's gonna be uh you know through this current pay per view into the next one. Well, yeah, that's half the fun. So yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be a uh, an event and featuring this, this these six wrestlers and whoever has the most points by the end of this little mini series Road to Gold series will face the currently Thanos, but whoever is the Mag Nation Green Champion at uh, Galactic Throwdown. Damn. Yeah. So, um, is everyone just still basically afa afraid of Thanos? Yeah, yes. And these are like the only six that are willing to fight Thanos? Essentially, yes. So, with a six man tag match, Ash, Ryu, and Kratos versus Optimus Prime, Kyle Ren, and Kazuya, the winning six man team will receive uh, three points apiece. There you go. So, uh, this could give Ash four points if he happens to. Pick this up a is win. really big for Ash and Ryu. Yeah, they they gotta they need this to uh, cause they, I mean well yeah because if Optimus Prime wins that'll put him at what eleven, so and Ash will be at one, or did they put him at twelve? I forget. I don't I already forgot the points they had. That'll put people at points. That would put people at points. It would. But is that the tag teams? Did I totally did I totally mess this up? Let's see. All right, so I didn't fuck things up. The graphics just weird. You'd think it'd be a three on the left versus a three on the right. Y Not true at all. In fact, it's Ryu, Kratos, and Kylo Ren as a tag team. And Ash, Optimus Prime, and Kazuya. Yeah, you think the graph... You, that, that's a perfect split. So uh, the teams, again, are Ryu, Kratos, and Kylo Ren versus Ash, Optimus Prime, and Kazuya. That's why I thought I fucked it up, because I didn't remember the... Uh, I thought the team was a little different, but it turns out, uh, no, the, the game's just weird with their images. That just doesn't make any sense to me. That's just dumb. Yeah, it is dumb, right? It is. It is dumb. So hopefully, if, if you got through that, thank you for sitting through this debacle with us. Oh, we've done way worse. Way worse. Here in Columbus, Ohio. Cheap pop. So the entrances are about... I actually about, just drove through there, like, this week. Entrances are about nine minutes. We got a little time to kill. We got a little time to kill. Frankly, by the length of this video, I'm honestly surprised it's this short. What do you mean? Six man tag is, are like historically like 45 minutes long. Oh. Well, you know, it's. Even on fast mode, it's like 45 minutes long. Well, Green just get things done in a compressed manner, you know? I might go to Waterford after this. Yeah? Yeah. I mean, they got shit going on. It's a nice day. Feature start at 6.30. Oh, so you'll be and out here. about an hour away. Yeah, you'll be out of here by about 5.30. 5.30 five, five five thirty the latest, yeah. About 5.30 you'll be out of here. But I'll, I'll show you who um, who's on the, uh, the server, or who's on my roster. And then that way, like, at some point today, just be like, you know, just text me what you want. Yeah, I'll give you that. But I imagine that you'd want, you know, the main people. Most likely, yes. Moon Knight, obviously. Uh, perhaps. Perhaps. Because I, uh, I still got people on there from, like, Strange Bedfellows and other things. Strange Bedfellows. Fun stuff. And, like, the draft pick matches. Well, yeah, let me know you got in there and, uh, we'll make this. And match. whoever got traded away is still probably on there. Uh, probably. Oh, I mean, yeah, probably. I added some people, but, like, I still have a bunch. Plus, I'm going to delete some women because. I probably had like 18 or 19 women. That's yeah, some good stuff though. That's not bad. That's a, that's a solid representation. Hey, yeah, I gotta whittle it down to 10. You do. Well, I'm just glad that you had that many in the first place. Mm-hmm. Here is Kazuya. The weird dancing of Kazuya. Which I don't understand, but uh, I'm not gonna try to. 
he's wearing not a suit this time. Yeah, he's not in a suit. Which is a little sad, in my opinion. You were a fan of Kasutya? He's undefeated while wearing a suit. Is he? He won. <laughs> That's just, you can't argue with facts, guys. Those are 100% accurate statistics, yeah. and you can't argue with those. Because he is the second member of the team. Because it was weird, and the image is weird. Yeah, I knew it was weird when I you know, saw the thumbnail. It doesn't make any sense. But, you, but you'd think it'd be just three, but nope, it's just some weird little fucking shuffle around. It, it's like diagonal, you know what I'm saying? There's some kind of weird diagonal. Alright, I'm gonna look at something. I don't get it. This, this is somewhat relevant. Okay. Just like versus Avengers. Okay. So there, 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 right there. Yeah, and there, right there. So they're all on the same side. Mine's it, the same exact thing. And you got three on three. Uh, How weird is that? Yeah, is it that? You have such weird luck. <laughs> well, they're, they're coming out like that, too. Like, look. They're coming out, Ash, Kazi, and Ryu. It, like, swapped the teams on me. Huh. Or no. Well, no, no. Wait, did they? Or do I have an old thumb? It's just weird. The thumbnail and that are different. Yeah. So it's Ash, Kazuya, and Optimus Prime. Versus Kylo Ren, Kratos. It's strange. It's very it's very strange. It's incredibly strange. It's very strange. I don't understand. You know what it is? What? Maybe it's because I did... Tria, or like at least uh, some form of like tag team for this. Maybe, dude. I don't know. It's Hulk and Iron Man are entering right now. It's very strange. And there's Captain America. It's very strange. Oh, and and Justice League came out like the new day. May, may, listen, I'm not saying you're wrong. And we got to record this at some point. Yeah, I'm not, it's just it's just weird. I don't understand. Cyborg, remember Cyborg? Yeah, he did stuff. I just, I don't know, man. It's just... Th I think I put Cyborg in just because, like, I was like, who can be Biggie Lennox? And obviously Cyborg. It's just, it's a weird fucking, it's weird. It's a weird phenomenon. Just this league. But... Just <laughs> this league. It is Kylo Ren, Ryu, and Kratos. The Kratos. The Kratos. Son of the South. We're finally starting the second team entries, and we're, you know, about six minutes in there, <laughs> Way it goes sometimes. Yeah, that was good. We can, like. We are in the Magnation Green Arena finally. We're not in the fucking Battleground Arena that we're more than some more. <laughs> the one that just automatically. Oh, schedule for today. Alright, what the features are. Anything good? Oh, good. The two features I don't give a shit about are, like, first two. What are those? It's SK. Nema SK Lights. There's 17 SK Lights. Yeah. You know what SKs are? Modifieds. Um, yeah, like, they're the top division. Yeah. It's basically the same exact cars, except with, like, a restrictor plate on them. And Ooh. with, like, brand new rookie drivers. That sounds kind of easy. Okay. Um, 17 is entirely too many. Entirely too many. Seven divisions racing, though. So I could miss Nemo in SK Lights, and I don't give a shit about those. I might do this. Holy crap, yeah. Okay. Go to, go to race, uh, what, six of the year, I think? Or five? Get her done! The Kratos, son of the self. Thompson went to Hickory. I went to drag racing. I went to Waterford. You said time at Waterford. Okay, cool. Racing five. Racing five. I love Kratos' entrance. That's good stuff. Oh, yeah. And then I might go to the party later on if it's not a sausage fest. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll let you know. I mean, I'm probably going to be there late because I'll probably go out there for a little while. And then she'll go to bed. Because she goes to bed at like 10, 30, 11. Yeah. And then usually after she goes to bed, I usually go to shots. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah. Hey, there's us. There we <laughs> are. <laughs> there More we are. entrance. <laughs> Get ready for Big Bang, because I did have, I do have like all six entrances for the Adam Wade and Blue Chamber already recorded. Here comes Ryu! Florida man buried his boss in dirt using the front loader. Right. That's incredibly Florida. That is. 
Ryu is really happy to be here, as you can tell by his antics. Sin Cara esque, or Kalisto esque, I guess. One of the two. I don't know. They're both the same way. Because they're both masks. Yo, fuck the Lucha Dragons, man. Hey. This, this, this is a stupid name for a team. It's so they can have, like. It's it's something very easy for the crowd to, ch to chant. I get it. It's just as an adult, like, as a kid, I'd love it. As an adult, I'm ridiculously like disenchanted. I don't know why they didn't disband the team. As a person that was drafting the SmackDown roster, I took advantage of that by picking both of them at number twenty-one. Okay. Yeah, this is when you get into like the yeah the shit. How did Alberto do that fall so fast? <laughs> I don't know. So I was like, fuck, I'll take him at 23. American Alpha over Alberto Del Rio? Yep. Shinsuke Nakamura 14. My roster is definitely the best. Yeah, that's a good one. Because that's, that's his. Oh, Randy Orton 2 on Raw? Yeah. Come on, man. I mean, he's got, like, Styles, Orton, Rollins, and Lesnar. And after that, Charlotte Our at 5? Yeah. The Revival? Who are the Revival? NXT uh, tag team. Oh, dude, you're killing me. Baron Corbin, yeah. No way. My, yeah. my, my team's like it's Cena, Owens, New Day, D'Ambrose, Reigns, Rusev, Cesaro, Asuka, Sami Zayn, Jericho, Nakamura, Neville, Becky Finn Lynch. Balor. Jesus. My, yeah, my roster is stacked. Yeah, it is. I, I think we're going to have, like, after the draft happens, we're going to have another one. Because, like, I kind of like the idea of us having just, like, a random wrestling podcast where it's just the bullshit and talk about wrestling. Yeah. Because, like, our, our, our last one got, like... Breaking More than 100 views. 421 views. I'll take that. Breaking the fourth wall. For us just talking about like wrestling for like an hour and a half, yeah. I'll take that all day. Might as well. We got, a cool little, we got a cool little photo for it, too. Yeah, I just screenshotted the Breaking the Fourth Wall podcast. <laughs> <laughs> just put it on there. <laughs> the Strange Bedfellas one. Dude. Big fan of that. That was an actual movie. Strange Bedfellas? Yep. I follow that same similar concept, I assume. Three dislikes for this, sir. What happened there? I don't really care. Don't Shout really. out to you, one guy that dislikes every single one of our videos. Whatever. <laughs> I, I'm, I, I, I'm not even mad at it. I'm just impressed by the dedication. Ash, catch him against the table. For uh, him to be subscribed to us and watch every single one of our videos and be like, fuck these guys. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, that's the one that's your time. By all means. I'm just, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, crap. I'm waiting. I'm driving. Oh, no. I'm driving the work van. Why? Ah, oh, you can't go to the work van? If anything happens, I'd be incredibly fired. Uh, <laughs> incredibly fired? Yeah. Would yeah, I can't go. Would they fire you, Trevor? Oh, yeah. They wouldn't fire you. They need you, Trevor. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to go. Well, is Bristol is kind of on the way, though, right? Nah. Isn't it? You go up Route 8, just get up, go up Route 8, go over. That adds on like an extra half an hour. I even did it like seven. Yeah. Not happening. Well, all right, you know. All right. Where am I getting my car? I don't know. I don't know what I want. I'll figure it out. Here comes Optimus Prime. And uh, Ryu and Optimus Prime going after them. Optimus Prime, arguably on like the best singles run in his career. I mean, he's currently in the road to gold to fight for the Magnation Green title, so they nothing to sneeze at. Nothing to sneeze at. <laughs> exactly, but like he had like a little bit of a singles run on blue, but like nothing near compared to like isn't he like leading the points or at least in like the top three? Yeah, he's got he's got uh, he's got eight. He's second place right now. That ain't he's bad. Tied with Kazuya. That ain't bad at all. And Kazuya's on his team, so uh, he can't. He can only gain ground. Him and Kazuya could tie for first if they win this match. Or Kratos. Or if Kratos wins, he'll have a four-point lead instead of a one-point lead. I mean, I'm all for Kratos. So, like, he was my boy for a while. He was. Ryu cut into the crowd. Look at, look at the look at the model of that person. Yeah. What 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 is that? It's terrible. Hey, no, don't run away. I didn't get a photo of this. <laughs> no, come back. <laughs> God damn it. Suplex. I want to make fun of the child in the front row. God. Yeah, I've never even heard of the Revival tag team. Dash and Dawson? Oh, that's them? I don't know that was their name. Yeah, I don't like that they had to give them names. The Revival. Curly. Generic 80s tag team. Huh? Probably they're good enough for, what, ninth round for them? I guess? 
Uh, I don't know. Tenth round? No way back? Sixth, Sixth round. round. Get the fuck out of here, dude. He took the revival, and then I took Rusev. Yo, that's total Mark City, man. Come on, you gotta. Baron Corbin. Then I took Cesaro. Ugh. Sasha Banks. And then I took Asuka. That's like really big. Taking the club at number nine. Separating them from AJ Styles. Ah, big fan of that roster. That roster's really good. Sami Zayn, tenth round. Yeah. Jericho in the twelfth round. Neville coming back. Who the hell's Tom Phillips? Sounds like, like an like an eight like an nineteen forty author. Why are you flying? Taking down Optimus Prime. He's the commentator for uh, NXT. Why would you draft him as a com draft him as a commentator or a wrestler? Commentator, because he took um, Mauro Ranello or whatever. Yeah, yeah. So like, all right, I'll take a commentator. I'll take Tom Phillips. Okay. Come on. Damn it. <laughs> Boot to the face. And then he took uh, his commentators are better than mine. Mauro Ronaldo and Paul Heyman. Fuck! No! <laughs> I don't want you! Oh, what, what kind of photo did that take? What a little flip move there. That was, that was really that was good. Right, let's turn you off, Flash. That sucks. I don't know you drafted commentators. Did you do that in the draft lottery? Well, he took Mauro Ronaldo, so I was like, alright, fine, I'll take Tom I feel Phillips. like he just didn't understand the rules of the draft. But, like, we took everyone. Who'd you draft with? Uh, Colonist, Sean. Sean McCarthy, your team is fucking awful. <laughs> you drafted the revival. How like how smarky can you be? They haven't even been on the main roster once. In the sixth round. What is this? I thought you asked in the eighth round. Yeah, but like that was after you took Cesaro and Rusev and Roman Reigns and Dean Ambrose and New Day and Kevin Owens and John Cena. Yeah. New Day, like probably the smarkiest answer that I did was Owens at two and New Day at three. Yeah, but they're like, I think the smartest thing you did was New Day at three. But they're hot. Owens is, you know. Beat Cena clean in his debut. Like, th what do you watch Raw for now? What do I watch Raw for? Like, you watch Raw for, like, some good matches. Yep. You watch Raw for New Day. Mm-hmm. Because they always do something fun. Mm-hmm. That's why I'm like, fine. Since, like, SmackDown's live, you can't, like, know full on, like, three days in advance of, like, what the New Day are going to do. Right. And they're probably going to be doing some dumb shit. And, like, if, if I got them cornered on my roster, I love, uh, you're going to tune in to see them. I love Kevin Owens, too, so. Yep. Dean Ambrose, Roman Reigns, oh. Rusev, Cesaro. Oh. It's so good. Colonist, you're, you're, if you're watching this, your roster is trash. You drafted a commentator? What are the rules? Revival at six. Are you out of your fucking mind? Well, that's my heel moment of the day. <laughs> and now we're back. Kylo Ren versus Optimus Prime. This is a match that I'm sure you all wanted to... Yeah, pulling a ball burn, I'm like... <laughs> I'm reverting back to my heel persona. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Isn't his um, comedy special coming up soon? Uh, actually, I think it is, yes. Yes. It is coming up soon, actually. The cover is actually already on Netflix. Like it's today Netflix. or something? Yeah, it's already on there. Yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yep. yep, everywhere yesterday. Awesome. Watching that tonight or tomorrow. What was it called? Make Happy. Make Happy. That's right, it was. I also recommend you watch the seven minutes of stand-up he did on Conan. Were they good? It, it was a lot of old shit. Mm -hmm. Like, he was like, oh, people accuse me of being flamboyant, and like, that's a lie, like, throughout the glitter. Wow. Sure, <laughs> My dad accused me of being flamboyant. He goes, what about that joke where you throw confetti in the air? And I go, I haven't heard that joke yet, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> this is a conversation from the future. <laughs> uh, I really like his comedy. Yeah, I do too. I, like, I was listening to um, to what a while ago. Mm -hmm. I, I think on like my trip back to um, yeah a few days ago actually. What? Two? Nope. These are the two points leaders are now duking it out. Kratos and Optimus. Ooh, he's elbowing Optimus Prime in the head. Big hits there. That's a robot, my friends. That is. It's a truck. Mm -hmm. Got a Cummins engine in there. We used to have two Cummins engine references in the same video. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to you, Cummins engines. Oh, God. Into the corner. Kratos and Optimus Prime. And, of course, Kazuya also tied for first, but... He's on the T, is on... He's not wearing a suit, so he doesn't count. Uh-oh. Are we going to do some crazy shit? Uh -oh. We're going to... He's a robot. He don't care about pain. No. Nope. This won't hurt him at all. There you go. And That's... Kratos is dead inside. Even dead inside because he killed his family. Yeah, he murdered his family. 
He's not even a good guy. You're playing an antagonist in God of War games. Yeah. You're playing an anti-hero. Yeah. I don't like you, so I'm going to kill you. He kills fucking family, dude. It's... So he kills gods. Yes, he does. The God of War games are amazing. I remember in 8th grade when they came out. I was in 8th grade. I haven't played any of them. There was, there's so much fun. My 8th grade gym teacher, the, when I first heard about that game, like it was in that class, and I remember, my, first, my 8th grade gym teacher it was how to make with John Cena. Nice. Yeah, that was like when John Cena like just kind of became a thing. Well, not just became a thing, but he was like right there. Like Actually, kind of. 8th grade, I was what, 15? So yeah. Like not like 13. 8th grade? Oh yeah, I was like 13. So, 12 years ago? Mm-hmm. When did John Cena debut? Oh. 2002? Something like that. Yeah, so he was just adjusting his way up. Ooh, God of War 3 remastered for like 20 bucks. Yeah, for PS4. It's yeah. a lot of fun, dude. 18 bucks on Prime. Ooh, I'll get here tomorrow. I don't need it tomorrow. You don't need to do this. <laughs> Double underhook suplex. What Throwing a weird Kratos. shit in my, in my cart. I believe you. I got a scale and I got a Captain America shield. <laughs> I'm not going to ask, but I, I of those things. Well, it's because, like, my scale of my, um, the bathroom broke. Like, it says that I weigh 122 pounds. I love you, scale, but that's just a fucking lie. So I was like, I wonder how much I weigh now, because I've, I've lost a decent amount. But I'm curious how much. So. Well, Kazoo is in the ring now. Another, he's tied for second with Optimus Prime, so. And I feel like it'd be badass in the uh, Garage Mahal to have, like, a, just a giant Captain America shield. The there. Garage Mahal. That's what Dale Earnhardt used to call his shot. The Garage Mahal. Yep. That's a good one. That's a good one. What is this submission? Oh, it's the dreaded abdominal stretch. No, he, had like a, he had his leg up and stuff. The dreaded stretch. <laughs> that will make me... It's like... There you go. 2K, like, takes the problems with the games and then just, like, blows them up. <laughs> yeah! What's the problem? Submissions happen on the downhill stretch? Now they never tap out. <laughs> to anything. It's like, oh, all right. It's, yeah, they just, I don't know, man. Oh, Ryu. Kazuya ja Oh, Ryu kicking him. They both look kind of similar. They do. Oh, the punch, the punches look like they hurt. Because the camera shakes. Look at the elbow. Oh, no, this has shaky cam, too. No, it's, it's not like Kevin Dunn shaky cam, but... Was that called the C4? Yeah, that was the C4. Why is that called the C4? Because it's cool. Why? Is it, what's the point of that? I don't get it. The cover. One. Two. two. Nope. Four. Yeah, I'll buy God of War. Yes. Add it to my card. Yo, the White Sox just got James Shields. Interesting. Yeah, that is interesting. Well, he's on the Cubs, right? He's on the Padres. Oh, yeah. His last start is where he pitched two and two-thirds and you have ten run runs. Ha! <laughs> he has five starts in his career. You don't have ten run runs anymore. Five. Red Sox have not had a good few games. <laughs> Red Sox are killing it. Lever Speed Rivals for 20 bucks? I figured I'm going to spend too much money on this stuff now. Neck break. You're going to play like Well, once. I just want a racing game. Get Rocket League. <laughs> There's cars there, in is it. Is there a Gran Turismo for this? Yeah, dude. It definitely is. With number six, I think. Sport? Uh, it's brand new. Oh, it's pre order. Oh, oh, come out in November? I might do that. Fuck it. Yeah, it looks really good, actually. I'm actually. I might get. Uh oh, another one? Another one? The same spot. In the same location. Who writes this garbage? Hey, she can't do that. Just a child. The risk of, like, Murder in that spot is retardedly high. Incredibly high. Like, if you go too much and like, their body goes across the bar, it can crack their spine. Hold on, back up. Right, what is this? Oh, back suplex there. Yeah, what I do with my Amazon cards, I just say I'm going to buy it and then I just let it sit there so I can, like, actually think it over. <laughs> Fair. I'm like, do I really want to spend all this money on all this? Like, the scale is something that I actually do want. The Captain America Shield has been preventing me from buying anything from Amazon for a while. Because I don't not want to buy it enough to, like, take it off my queue. Yeah. But I don't want to buy it enough to buy it. I so see. it's just been, like, holding, holding everything up. 
Kazuya, it's now Kazuya and Ryu again. We haven't seen a lot of Kyle Ryan since the beginning of the match, though. Uh, been, I feel like that's smart. It's been going for about 20, oh, 15 minutes. Oh, yeah. It's just took a while. Yeah, this, yeah, like, this is going up on Monday, the 6th. Yes, the day that I'm leaving for Georgia. The cover. What time do you have tomorrow off? Two! I have tomorrow off. Yeah. Tomorrow's the day that i got to get everything ready for my party. I, I, I. Triangle choke. Elbows to the head. Elbows to the head. Which means I'm going to clean this room up and I'm going to clean the basement up and get everything set up. Are there any events going on tomorrow? You're going like, to watch in the background? A couple ways. Oh, okay. all right, there you go. Here comes Kyle Ren now. Um, as if on cue. So I'll probably just like take a break and watch the cup race and then like keep going. Yeah, it's like a productive day. Oh yeah, I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. I have no idea. No idea what I'm doing tomorrow. Probably <laughs> something with a scooter again because I got to hang that hill. I don't know how beat me. <laughs> Damn double stomp! I could kill a man. Well, if you want to see X-Men Apocalypse early, I'm game. I'm, I'll probably be up late though, so I don't know if I'm going to get up to 10 a.m. I don't know. It's so satisfying watching a movie early though. Ah, uh, probably. Because just no one bothers you. Like, I'd probably go to Southington even, because it's like. I don't know why I'd go to any other theater now. Look up times and then. Maybe. I don't know. It's right by our house. Yeah, look up there, we'll see. Um, Although you probably wouldn't be sleeping in your house. Uh, I, I always sleep in my house. Sure you do. No, I do. Oh, I'm really? Not, I'm not sleeping there. I didn't parents are there. Oh, oh, yeah. If That's that right. Noise. If that noise. Yeah. Oh, God, I forgot about that. Mm -hmm. Ren. Uh-oh. Bloody Sunday. Uh, is that what it's called? I think so. Who does that move? Kim Balor. I think he calls it like 1919 or something like that. 1916, something like that. Oh, we got uh, some chaos ensuing in the ring. Because that's like the actual date of one day, Bloody Sunday. That's right. Yeah. Smart. Smart. What do we got for X Men's probably down at the bottom? X Men. Oh, Turtles. Turtles. Garbo. 11 30? Ugh, it's possible. It is possible. Eh, I don't know. Let's see. Not a lot of early movies, though. Same, same thing for Brass Moon. Oh, that's a shame. Cause that's, that, that interrupts my like watching a race time. I mean, I, that means I might just like move and like watch something like later on that night. That way I get everything done, and then I, you know, watch a movie. Kyle Ren, no, Ash, Ash, get out of here. Reverse DDT. Ash really needs this win. Y yeah. The cover one, two, chaos, kick out, near fall, the cannon, and suplex of Kratos. Optimus Prime throwing Ryu over. Jesus. There is just... Pile driver? Nope. No. What's that word you used to describe chaos in the ring? You know with the letter M, maybe? Or C? Oh. You know what I'm talking about? There's a word that you used. I don't remember the word. I'm sure the comment section knows. Yeah. Huh. Don't recall the name. Yeah. Hmm. Huh. What the hell? Were, what the hell are their names? What, what, what was the word he used? You know the C maybe? Uh, I don't know. Calvin Kid? No, no, no. It was used to describe like in cast in the ring, like the ring broke down. I don't remember. I don't know. Just... Discombobulation? No, no, no. I think it began with the letter M. Here's the deal. No one can say the deal. <laughs> Fucking Colossus. Just gonna add to that. Cover. For like seven months. One, two, careful. The fact that. <laughs> yeah, the fact they didn't kick out of the deal. Yep. Just gonna keep this going. Uh, what was the name? I can't, I can't remember that word now. It's killing not to, to know this. It was like... Mm, was it on blue? Not remember. We used to, used to say it. it. was like Medlum or something. Bedlam or something. I don't know. I'm just... I have no idea. I have no idea. What a... Oh, missing with a kick. It's sad that I don't remember my own words. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember. Hey, my clock's crooked. Hit him with some kind of like a, like a front code breaker. That was kind of weird. The clock is crooked. It's incredibly wrong. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's neither the 16th nor is it a Monday and it is also not 10 15. Uh, that's what I get for stealing a clock from Bridgeport. The warehouse. That's such like a work clock. Yeah. Like is. when I see that clock, I just internally get depressed. 
So I've never seen that kind of clock like in a time of enjoyment <laughs> or amusement. I've always been like I'm looking at it because I want to know when I'm leaving. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. yeah, I'm going to hang up my uh, my big car thing downstairs. I'm going to hang up my sheet metal. Oh, a skull crushing finale looks like that was. Yeah, I, I bought another one too. <sighs> you just said you weren't buying more. Well, I bought one like a few days ago. It's it's my favorite driver, so I had to. Who is it? Brad Keselowski. Oh, okay. If it was like anyone else, I wouldn't have done it. But since it was Brad Kozlowski, I was like, all right. Yeah. Because, yeah. I do know. I mean, come on. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Like, it's my boy. I had to. Kratos, top rope. It's a little Ghana's throwback. It's a throwback to Bobby Bobby. It's really the cover. Oh. Yeah. Hey, I got the car over there. It's so cool. Dropkick to the back by Kratos. Ooh, I got Venom Energy Drink. How is that? Pretty good. That's for a dollar. That was like newbie's favorite energy drink for like a while. It's so same sometimes with the Seymour Stop and Shop. Isn't that depressing? Yeah. Today is my four-year anniversary of working at, uh, at my work. Yeah? Four years today. The cover. One. Two. two. Near fall. Four years, huh? Yeah, and I showed up that day, and Pete had no idea that I was starting. Same with me when I started. Yeah. Will almost fucked both of us. What did you do in your first day? <laughs> They're like, um, do recycling. All right. Because we didn't have a Lonnie back then. Oh, really? You hired a Lonnie. I was the Lonnie. Dropkick. I was so I was like so on the bottom that I was the, the Lonnie. I've moved up to having a desk. Ah, uh, yeah. That took four years. That's why I'm hoping in another, like, couple... He did the deal! No one kicks out of the deal. That's why I'm hoping in another couple years, like... It's gonna be Pete. Yeah, because I think Pete wants to move away at some point in the next couple what years. What? Outside there is mayhem going on. So, hey, look. Make me that. Hire someone else that'll do my shit. You, know, you, just, you get to go home every night. Yeah. That'd be the dream. That means I can, like, you know... No, Ash and Ryu on the outside right now. Just going at it. Can you make that match happen? Like, a one-on-one -on -one match between those two? Maybe. I kind of want to see that match. They're just going at it out there. Did you see that? Because, like, like, you got a lot of dream matches here. Like, I really want to see, like... Huh. Who do I want to see Kratos fight in your roster? I don't know. Maybe, uh, Thanos. If he wins. He's currently, he currently, right now, he's, he's on top. That could change with one pinfall. He could be in second place. Or in first by more. I kind of want to see, like, Ash versus Kyle Ren, too. Yeah? Yeah? Do you? Like the bratty little kid versus each other. We have turned Ash into a bratty. He, Ash has been a hero for, like, three years. At least. Yeah. What a top rope suplex, or back suplex, and Kazuya's feeling the effects of that one. He's just elbow, and he missed the elbow drop. That's just a shame. Yeah. Well, he's drunk. Kicking Kyron in the face. In the face. In the face. Here's the sound a tired man makes. <laughs> nah, I just have a sore throat. I understand. It's almost done. That's so I'm like, ah, do I want to go to the racetrack or do I want to just like stay here? I'm like, <laughs> I would say just stay here. I mean, today and tomorrow, just gonna chill. You know. That's true, but I don't like having an open Saturday and not doing anything. Yeah. So it's, it's a tough. It's a tough thing. I can see that. Cause he dropping to one knee. He is really feeling the fatigue, but he's not tagging out. No, he's not. I feel like that's a bad situation in hindsight. Bad, bad choice. Kyle, here comes Kratos, and Kazuya just punching Ryu, disregarding the fact this Kratos is, is there. And punches right, and Kratos is lifting him up. Pile driver! Busting him open! Will that distraction... It wasn't even a distraction, it was a lapse of judgment. The cover by Kratos won. Oh, Kazuya grabbed the rope, and the ref didn't even see it! The ref didn't even see it! Oh my... Kazuya grabbed the rope, but the ref the ref was not a position. Wow. This is one you could... A case Vintage could, Yamcha. It was a case you could have legitimately make if the ref was out of position, because he was. Or you just make fun of a... Uh, yeah, I'm sure. Realist chicken in the coop. 
Did you know that Carmel used to be a Patriots cheerleader? Really? Yeah. Now I know a Patriots cheerleader. Yeah. I can't see that. Well, Kazuya punching Ryu and then dis disregarding the pile driver from Kazuya or from Kratos. And that was uh that's what did it. Wow, controversial ending of this match. Yeah. But it is the ending nonetheless. It certainly is. So here, if, if they show it, hopefully they show a pinfall. Because you'll see how he was out of position. And with the, you know, it, it made some sense in the realms of kayfabe here. Oh, man. See, as you can see, look, it, look at his position. Like, you can't even tell, right? Nope. You can't even tell. There's no way you can tell. There's no, no. way. So, Kylo Ren, Kratos, and Ryu, even though know, they're not together in the photo. <laughs> That's the happiest I've ever seen Kylo Ren. I mean, he's, he got some points. And now let's take a look real quick before we sign off at the uh, the current road to gold points, and we'll <laughs> see where we are. Because I talk first. I always yeah. talk first. Except that you actually talk first. God damn it. <laughs> Here's the new point stand. Damn it, Ash! Ash with one. Optimus Prime with eight. Z with eight. Kyle Ren with six. Ray with five. And, of course, Kratos with 12. Damn so. it, Ash. Mediocre!